this is after I had four treatments for the magnets. And from what I hear, magnets do heal cancer or tumors, and, and there's many benefits to it. And just I'm glad to report Well, banana's not cancerous anyway. Well, yeah, but they said it was gone. range, which is alpha theta, which is where you're asleep, but dreaming, mm -hmm. like REM sleep, light sleep, not delta, not deep sleep, and alpha, which is where we are right now, just awake and relax, right? 10 hertz, mm -hmm. okay? So what that does is that, it, that stirs up repressed memories and repressed emotions. Um, it also allows access to the subconscious mind. So while you were doing alpha theta neurofeedback training, you were also listening to a self-hypnosis design for releasing anger. No, oh, okay. And that's the same thing that we're gonna do today. So we're just gonna keep doing that. Okay. We're gonna keep hitting it from both ends. From he physical. said he did one and he was bawling like a baby uncontrollably. Yeah. yeah. Really? <laughs> you can have an app reaction. That's what it means. Yeah, an app reaction. Wow. Yeah, you can have an app I won't get me in my no, actually, okay. I, after, after, yeah, after I let out the emotion, I had four strangers compliment me on my happiness and on my energy the same day. Really? Mm -hmm. 
Mm -hmm. Same thing. Because once you release, it's like, oh, I just feel so light. Do it. Mm -hmm. What you're doing is uh, you're trying to get back to the memories that occurred before eight or nine years old when we develop a critical mind. Because all of those are the, um, uh, everything that happened before in your first eight years of life goes directly into your subconscious. You don't have a filter. The filter comes at eight or nine years old, the critical mind, uh, where you start second guessing what you're hearing. It's mm -hmm. like, okay, well, maybe I believe that, maybe I don't, right? Mm -hmm. You just believe everything I You just right? believe everything, it yeah. just comes right in. And, and so that's the scripts that we all live. Mm -hmm. And then all of the BS that we go through in life are echoes of the scripts. That's why we find ourselves in the same situations, even though they make us unhappy over and over and over again. Mm -hmm. the, the, wow. the trick is to go hop skipping back in your mind and be courageous enough to go back to the same whatever scenario that occurred at or before eight years old. Okay. And then once you reach that, then and don't be afraid to face it, you will have an app reaction. And, um, and if you want, we can actually go through the belief reformation process, which is a specific guided, reform, uh, guided um, it's not a guided meditation, um, but, but it, 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 it is guided imagery where um, we walk you back through. You find that specific thing, process it, see yourself as that child experiencing whatever that was, mm -hmm. console that child as yourself, right? Mm -hmm. And then turn to whoever it was, usually it was a parent, mm -hmm. that caused the situation and honor them for having fulfilled their contract, whatever it was with you. And then whatever it is that you did not get from them, you're gonna to have to provide for yourself. And you let them know that. Because everybody has a contract now we look at the television and we think everybody's contract is exactly the same. Mm -hmm. But you know, if we understand that you know the life that we're living isn't the first or the last life that we're going to live, and that life is worth living, and we all love being alive, then we have to extrapolate from that that we probably chose to have the life that we are living now, mm -hmm. and that meant all of the BS that came with it. Well. And you got to look at it from that way. Because if you try it with the forgiveness thing, forgiveness requires you to condemn. And not everybody's down to condemn. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And some things, you don't want to go through all of that negativity just to reach forgiveness. Mm -hmm. No, just say, hey, it's like a contract. You know, it's like, well, you fulfilled your contract with me. You were here to provide me with this. And for the rest of what I need, I provide for myself. And that's how you can bring closure to it. You can reach the subconscious mind. You can dig out that that uh, experience, relive it if you have to, experience the emotions attached to it, console yourself, thank or honor the person that gave you that experience, and then rejoin yourself, reintegrate yourself with that younger person, with that inner child. Okay. Yeah. And then just close it out. You know? So, okay. so, so what we're doing now is we're going to do the body scan, and then we'll get it from the emotional side. Now, if it's overwhelming for you, then afterward we'll do a meridian cleanse of your mm -hmm. gravity meridian with one of these powerful magnets. Okay. And what that does is it helps the body to release um, negative emotions. You have to give yourself permission to release the emotion though, so that it can, come, it can come out. And I can also body test you here Questions are Is there an emotional base? And look, look, I'm looking at it now. You can see it. Mm -hmm. You can see the foot right there. Is right. there an emotional base that wants to heal? We're going to do the scan. You have that negative, mm -hmm. right? To touch your body. And we're going to go from pre-pineal. Okay. You the negative? Yep. Yes. Pre-pineal. All right. And let's get the band. Okay. Yeah. Now 
time we had that yesterday, didn't we? Yeah, we had it yesterday, huh? Mm -hmm. That's right. That's right. So, uh, yes. It's close enough. Or, let's see, you can put a cup there, but the cup is a, 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 a cup, like a regular drinking cup, and just put the magnet in the cup, but it's, it doesn't really hold it any closer. That's, that's fine, right? Yeah, yeah that's fine. Okay. Hold this one. <laughs> so, so now, since we have well, a you guess, know what? You can do the clip now. It's, you can clip that and it holds out higher. So now, since prepaneo is a yes, let's go to all of the pairs associated with prepaneo. Okay. Okay. That's weird bodies on those people. <laughs> right? Yeah. Looks like uh, scary. It looks like from the um, Sims game. Right. Something, yeah. Pre-Pineo Bobo Rahilio, which is uh, the brain stem. That's the um, the bobble head, right? They call, right it's yeah. the bobble thing? I call it a bobble, the bobble head. Oh, yeah. the bobble head thing? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, um, pre to the brain stem. Things are associated with that one. Parkinson. But let's try it anyway, right? Okay. So now we go creeping in when you put the positive back here. Put it down. Just put it down. Put it down. Like right there. Okay. Now. Okay. 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 No, it's not Parkinson. Just get that one off? Yeah. Encephalitis in children, uh, glaucoma in the eyes, infections, uh, ocular infections for the eyes, or for aggressive, uh, aggressiveness. Aggressive. All right, so we're going to put them right next to each other. Psoriasis. 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 Ps
do any or look up any um for the fibromyalgia? I thought we looked it up yesterday. Huh? No, we didn't look it up. We were going to look it up, but we didn't. He wants to rent me this spot next door, but I don't really have a need for it right now. And it'll always be there because nobody wants to uh, hear those dogs barking all day. <laughs> right. Fibromyalgia. If you want, we can we can focus on these today. No, 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 not for her. It's for her mom. I just want to know where you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Five. Twenty four. Twenty four twenty four points, okay? Mm -hmm. Appendix plura, right? So Okay, when they say appendix plura, does plura mean appendix? Is that why it's like that? No. Appendix what the, what the hell is a plura? Appendix. The plura is right here where they're putting the they're showing you the positive. The first position is where the negative goes, the second is where the positive goes. Yeah, I know, but it's just I don't know that's like a different one, language to me. It is, the second. it is another language, it's Spanish. Well, that would be why. That's why I was asking you. So that's appendix, but that's appendix in Spanish. Right. It's that's all in I mean. Spanish. <laughs> it's, it's all in Spanish. You didn't okay. try in Spanish? No, I didn't mind. How would I try in Spanish? I can't even speak Spanish. But the goes... No, it's not. But my so, book is English. I read the English version on my of book. This? Of this? Where my book's at. But is it from Goyes? Yes, it's from Goyes. Really? I believe so. But who was the instructor? Oh, you did it online. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, no, 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 no. The, the, the in-person training is done in Spanish. Well, how the hell is that even impossible if I can't do Spanish? Well, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> there were translators. Stephanie, actually, my instructor for um, um, a Belief Reformation, mm -hmm. she is the translator. So they give you headphones in class. Oh. And so she translates in real time. It's your kid. I just put on so yeah, all, all, all of these points, right? Uh, right? Negative here, positive at the brain stem. These are all for fiber But let's get back yeah. to the scan. All right. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. We have a lot more to go to. Um, we already hit the nails. Um, and we've already hit the right, pituitary superior part the face, central part of the forehead on the mid plane. Uh, forehead. On the mid plane, yeah. So, uh -huh. where's that at the right in the forehead? Uh -huh. Or central? No, 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 right here, right here. Okay. Relax, relax. Uh, well, let's see. Um, pituitary. Oh, well, I don't know. It, it's pituitary it was, yeah. was what we put it for yesterday, right? Yeah. yeah, yeah. See, now we're going from what your body says, right? Yeah, we're going on not what your symptoms are, but what your body's telling you. And the bodies are saying that. Symptoms yesterday said it got worse. It was pituitary, I believe. Yeah. Yeah. Now. All right. Uh, right 
temple. Left temple. Okay, we'll start it up. Just hold it. Alright. Right temple. Okay. Left temple. Do you have more temple? I think it's hard to find one. Holy cheese, is that? It's not far enough, dude. Okay, no. Alright. Um, I'm gonna do the right one again because I didn't have the right spot. Okay, right temple. Nope, no. Alright, right ear. Left ear. No. Right jaw, right here, mastoid. Okay, relax now. Left mastoid. Cheekbone. Left cheekbone. Okay. Right side of the tongue, the mouth, right on the outside. I was like, no, stick it in your mouth. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right side of the mouth on the outside. Left side, same place. <laughs> Left and right mandible, right under here. Under right. Here. Okay. Left. Okay. That's right. That's right. Mm -hmm. All right. No. Left. Okay. okay. Thyroid gland. Much. No, no, the mandible is here, thyroid is here. Okay. That's I'm on the left right now. Yeah, the left thyroid. Right. Right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That is a yes. So now we're going to do this. These are already, that's what these teardrop ones are for. That's why you said that they had removed it, mm -hmm. right? So that's, that's what it is. Scar. It's the healing. You need healing there. That's why it's the shape. Mm -hmm. Does that scar still hurt you? Or is it still tender? Okay. No? Yeah, no, there's, there's probably tissue that needs to still needs to be healed. Okay. Um, <clears throat> Thymus gland. Okay, so now because it's the thymus right here. Okay. Oh, yep. Okay. No, and that's good because we got a positive yesterday on the thymus. It must have been because we used those big power mm -hmm. Here at the medial spinal. Like when you get hit. Yeah, the that's the worst part to get hit. Okay. Sitting there. Yeah, that one really yes, it's a yes. Okay, so now. So now that you got a positive on that, then what did you do? Now we're going here. But what should it say on here? When you got a positive, for what, where were you at? You need to on. No, it doesn't give you a, a, any diagnosis. Mm -hmm. This is the first part of the pair. Mm -hmm. So now we come here to all of the pairs. Okay. And we find mediastinium. And then we, we put a positive on the other part, one at a time, of all of the... 
parents that cool with the media sent sent it to them. Mm -hmm. So I mean that's alphabetical. That would help. It would never be people too. Media Stino, okay. Media Stino. Now we start with media Stino pericardia. Okay. So we put a positive over right above the heart um, on the left side, obviously, where the heart is. Right. Okay. Can you flip? Or just hold it there, you mean? Yep. Just hold it there. And we'll see if... I don't have one already here. Just need more. No, 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 no. You have to yeah, bring a pair. Yeah. Okay. So let's go back to the medial stadium. Go negative right here on this right, one. Right, right. Let's go back to exactly where we were because we have to get the feet uneven again. Because that's this one. Right there. That's where it was, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. Okay. Now put the other one on the pericardium. Uh, positive. Uh, positive, yes. Above the heart, you said? Yeah, right above the heart. You see what I it is? the heart was lower. You see what it is? It, it's the pericardium. You see You see where the... Uh, the, the it, Your cursor's in the way, I think. The diagram is? Oh. So yeah, I'm in the right spot. Yep. Well, it depends how low that chick's... Boob sag. <laughs> <laughs> but she looked like she was passing the pencil test to me. Right. right. <laughs> okay, so that's it right there. All right, so let's see. Mediostinium pericardio, uh, ethmoiditis, glaucoma, <laughs> uh, the, the lungs, principal attack of the lungs. Kidneys, general immunodefense, pulmonary problems, lung, lung problems, allergies. Says allergies. Uh huh. Combined with up with others, uh, can have sicknesses uh, of the eyes, dangerous sicknesses of the eyes, uh, mucosis of the skin. Pneumonia, asthma, bronchitis, tuberculosis, a lot of things could be. Wow. Uh, ocular pension. Inverte mass, that's nine minutes. I don't know what that means. I'm going to have to translate that. But, okay, so. This is a obviously a very common mm -hmm. common location. So now what we'll do is we'll replace those with some nice strong neodymiums and let them get busy. Negative. That's so weird. It's cool, huh? This thick part. Uh, the, oh yeah. I think it's opposite. No, a light distract, right? Yeah. I mean a light repel. And it's opposite to track. Well, that was your phone, right? Uh, no, that actually that was our camera. Oh. Somebody's just left my house or came to my house, whichever. Oh, that's cool. You know, I, yeah. <laughs> Mine does that outside here. Does it? Uh -huh. I haven't set it up with an audio yet. I just look. Look to see if I should just get it. Like we are there. <laughs> Come on now. <laughs> All right. Well, that's cool. Yeah, and look. Back even. You see? Mm -hmm. So that's good. Hey, Bob's letting her take the car? Mm -hmm. Huh? Mm -hmm. Like, away? I think so. Yeah, because it's in our driveway right now. Yeah. Is he, are you sure? He knows he's got she's got the car. I had her go pick him up and take him to the house. And he was okay with that, didn't he? Yeah. Okay. And I told him to ask if he, he can't be driving. Yeah. Huh. Okay, my cousin was mine. Okay, so cardia. Is cardia, cardia, is that the same thing as cardio? Cardia is 
you did a pericardium, now you're going to cardio, which is the inferior edge of the xiphoid process on the midplane in the epigastric region. So that's kind of under the breast right here. Okay. Okay, so we're gonna put a negative at cardio. There you go. Oh, she got a bra on though. Like, ooh. It's okay. Yeah, yeah. You see how it's gonna grab the other one. Yeah, grab the other one hard. Now, what about the positive one? No, 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 there's no, there's no response for cardio. No, where's the positive one though? Only if there's a response. Oh, you see right. what I'm saying? Gotcha. Yeah, only if there's a response, then you look for the other one. Uh, only, you know, only if you look the foot shrinks. Okay, the stomach. Okay, right at the stomach. Okay. Which is right here. Which is kind of hard because she's got two of them already in the stomach region. Nope, doing good. Uh, head of the pancreas, the superior of the stomach, on the superior border of the navel and the midplane. You already got some. Already, yeah, we've already done pancreas, pancreas, yeah. We've done pancreas already. Alright, we've already done that. A spleen, superlateral to the pancreatic ligament on the maxillary line between the ninth and eleventh rib. Subclavial, right underneath here. That's when people break that, huh? Uh, yeah. Oh my God. You don't want to do that. That's the seatbelt. Yeah, that's what the seatbelt snaps. I had, yeah, I, I've, <laughs> I've been well aware of that one. <laughs> yeah, every time someone comes into the ER and they say, was he wearing a seatbelt? This is broken, and I believe one of these two mm -hmm. because of the strap, yeah. right? It's always. I wasn't broken. I, this was, I broke my, I broke my sternum. In the seatbelt? The sternum, no, the sternum hit the steering wheel. It, but it broke it this way, it that cracked hurt. it this way, yeah. not the normal way. But that hurts. Like yeah, it's day. still healing. Oof. Okay, so. That's good. Relax now. Relax. Now try the other one. So. Well, you got one there already. Sore throat, no, uh, no tonsil issues. Good, 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 good. Uh, uh, deltoids. So now we're going to hit just the right and left deltoid, right on the side of the shoulder. Right here. Outside. On the inside. Yes. Subdeltoid, proximal medial part of the arm, 
on the cor uh, coronal plane on the outside. Anterior part of the arm on the elbow is bent bilateral. Okay. Oh no. Radio, radius. Left and right wrist. Outside or inside? Anterior and central part of the wrist joint. anyway at the end of the circulation. You don't have any circulatory problems to the arms or hands? Her hands get numb. Yeah, it does in a long time. No, okay. So we're going to do the arms anyway. Yeah. Okay. Uh, index finger, left and right. You know, like you're getting fingerprinted. <laughs> right. I like you're putting a machine. <laughs> <laughs> I like you getting put finger in that machine for, for oxygen. Right, you put that finger. <coughs> okay, pleura inferior to the armpit, uh, eight to one and a half inches on the mid axillary line, and the third to fourth. We're already there, though. We're already there, right? Okay. Mm -hmm. And that's the same here. Okay, liver, we've already got liver. Uh, Perihippocratic, inferior to the liver on the inferior coronal border. We don't have the pancreas, we need to. Well, this one is the liver, right? This one yes, is the liver. they're both on the liver, and that is pancreas. That was pancreas. Uh -huh, that's pancreas, pancreas. Um, oh, so these two are pancreas right here. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Inferior to the mammary gland on the right mid clavia line on the fifth and seventh intercostal spain, gallbladder on the right, inferior to the right. Okay. There we go. Right here? Yes. No, well, you know, the gallbladder sits in the liver, right? No, I did not know that. Yeah, it does. It sits up in the liver, right on the... Not very fine. The gallbladder is in your liver? Mm-hmm. I didn't know that. 
Yeah. It's responsible for the release of bile and it also tears down all sugars. of the sugars and all of the oily foods, all of the fats and all of the good stuff. Mm. All of the burgers, fries, all of the fried foods. And, Cystic duct, this is part of the gallbladder. Okay. Uh, the gallbladder is in for, inferior to the bile duct right here on the right. We already got some. Right? We already got some. Okay. Pancreatic duct, we already got the pancreas. Duodenum, inferior to the pancreas duct on the right. It's clavicular line, the inferior part of the right flank on the right. Okay, so we're going to go right. Here. Right up higher. Inferior to duodenum on the super or medical part of the iliac fossa and the superior part of the iliac fossa. So we're going down further. What's the, what the hell's the iliac fossa? Uh, the iliac valve right here. Which is what? Okay. Ascending colon, ascending colon, right here on this side. All right, the, 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 the hip bone, mm -hmm. right above it, right there. Okay. Yep. So I'm going to put a powerful one, neodymium, on the ascending colon. Actually, let's put one here. It's a one on the Ascending and descending. You always get the right wish. I got hooked on those Hawaiian fruit that they sell. Yeah. Um, what do you call those? Mar Marriott. Mm -hmm. What are those um, olives? I don't know. Marinara olives, the one with the little red thing in the right, middle. Right, right. Um, they sell like prunes and stuff, mm -hmm. all kinds of other dry fruits. Try that Hawaiian mix. It's it's not no prunes in it, but it's all the dry mm -hmm. pineapple and mango and everything. Mm -hmm. That's a dick. I mm -hmm. eat it before I go to dinner. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now let's see. First colon, inferior border of the navel of the mid plane, okay? Where are you, where is it? Uh, yeah, instead of the navel. Our, yeah, inferior border of the navel, right yeah. there at the mid plane. Just put it negative, okay? No, you're right, because this is already a strong negative right there. Uh, descending, we've already hit. Sigmoid colon, okay, now, sigmoid. The bone, your. Your hip bone? Your hip bone is where? Right here? Yeah. Okay. Hip bone is here. Navel is here. Where is your hip bone? Up there? Maybe. Up here? On this side? I can't find it. You gotta find it for us. Yeah, yeah find it. <laughs> Tell me where it's at. Right there. Right there. Right here. So you draw a line okay. from your navel to your hip bone, and you can practice this on yourself, okay? Um, press down here. Mm -hmm. If you feel any discomfort, other, That's what the doctors do. Yeah. Going for it. Right. Other than my hand, right? Mm -hmm. Now, the sigmoid colon is shaped like an S. That's why it's called sigmoid, right? This is your descending colon. It comes down, goes into an S, and then comes out. Because of that S shape, mm -hmm. it tends to hold mucus. Okay. So if you, you eat to? meat, no, no, it's Other only here. Side. It's okay. only one side, right? It goes up, goes across, goes down, S's mm -hmm. and out. So right here mm -hmm. is where. You want to put it, okay? Yeah. Should hear that. But yeah, that's the the same white colon, and, and and for some reason men have more of a problem with it than women. With mucus. I think it's.
just because we like the meat. <laughs> Inferior lateral to navel. Oh, the ureter. Uh, and then the and we're going to try both ureters, left and right. I don't know what that is. Superior to the bladder and to the superior part of the okay, so that's further down like to the pelvic area, yeah, on the left and the right side. Yeah. Ovary lateral to the uterus and the superior part. Okay. It's gonna be like right here. So, exactly. Lateral to the uterus. Same place for the left. It's going to be down. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Or maybe a little bit more inside, right? No testicles. <laughs> yeah, testicles. Right? You're fine. You like it? <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, we're going to try this. Is it hot here than me? You know what? Yeah, it is hot. I tried to turn my AC down yesterday, and for some reason, I don't want to have to call the fan or... <laughs> Big balls. She's got big balls. <laughs> I got pee pad. You got pee pad? You got pee? Mm -hmm. Are you serious? Mm -hmm. Well, that's all bad. Yeah, I'm a swimmer. Like an hour? <laughs> no. I swear to God. <laughs> On the table. Oh, would you like me not to push in the bladder then? Huh? <laughs> So how's that going to work? Because you've got a pee badge, you said. Oh, you got to go? <laughs> Uh-oh. Really? It's okay. I can hold it. Yeah. <laughs> just, don't, just, just don't push on her bladder. But you still got, we're not even done scanning, so you, you yeah. have, your time hasn't even started yet. Yeah. But I mean, you know, we can, we got to hurry up then because we can hurry up and then she can be done by the hour, right? By 12. I because I don't know if she can hold it exactly. Okay, so let's I can just, hold it. You can hold it. Okay, okay. All right, so, all right, where were we, where were we? Well, we could just work on the, the known problems right now. Yeah. And then we can, and then we can continue to scan yeah. it next time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. we're going to be here all week. Okay, yeah. so. Uh, um, There's, there was, we had more on there yesterday. We had, we had some on our side of our face right here, remember? Yeah, I remember these two. Yeah, that, that's the thing. Uh, we had one on, there was one in the middle of the forehead yesterday. Uh-huh, it was on this side. Okay. All right, right here. Oh, yes, and we did have... For, uh, what's it for? Emotion, no, for uh, stress? Yeah. Yes, exactly. And on this side. Mm -hmm. She you did. You did? Oh. Sure. Yeah. It's all the damn water you have her drinking. And it's also the it's also the magnets uh, moving the fluids around. Mm. It's definitely cranking on your I mean, we did your you know yeah. once again, right? We did your kidneys. Yeah. Your kidneys are sending pee right to your bladder. Hey, didn't <laughs> we also had something on her butt crack. What was it? Mm. Both sides. 
Um, that was one of these two, uh -huh. but now we're using these two on this, okay. this way. So uh, this one underneath that spreadsheet and um, the positive, positive. Over here, yeah. or in the negative? Negative, yes, yeah, so negative yeah. facing her. What about your, 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 what are they called? Testies. <laughs> <laughs> I can't remember what the hell they were. I was going to say balls, but I just didn't seem right. <laughs> Negative and positive right here. See if you can have what the color is. So, what if you have like uh, a lump, a big, I should call it a knot, that moves around in your testes? And that, you know, I would recommend. That's painful. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I've never heard of that before, but I mean, I would recommend seeing a doctor. Yeah, he did. He saw a doctor, and the doctor said it was um, fluid buildup. It was really fluid buildup. Yeah, but if it changes or something like that, my son, if it changes or something, that he probably would have to have some sort of surgery to. Really? Yeah, I'm like, I don't know about him. Yeah. Jeff's like, I don't know if I want you cutting on my nuts. Yeah, exactly right. <laughs> if it's not broke, I wouldn't be fixing it. All right. <laughs> For sure. Well, what are those? Those? What do they do, anyways? I mean, what are they for? I mean, obviously not for sex. Testicles? Yeah. They produce the sperm. They produce the future human beings. So they that, produce the zygotes. Gotcha. Yeah. So you need them. You need them. Because <laughs> I want bad kids. Yeah. I could try to give them half of them. He's like, Mom, them. I'm only 18. I don't want kids yet. I said, just have it and I'll take it. <laughs> that's why they call them the family jewels. <laughs> right. That makes sense. And that's for circulation? Uh, yes. Not the family jewels. I know what they are. No, 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 no. Because she, she's got yeah. a little bloating down here. And her wrists. And the wrist, yes, yes. So I want to make sure that we get as much circulation around here. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 So, you know, that's kind of the process. Yeah. Tomorrow, yeah. we'll get it done. So, I know I said, this time hasn't started for you for your change yet. <laughs> I know, right? So, this one is stronger than this one? Neodymiums are stronger than the ceramic ones. Yeah. This one right here is ceramic? Mm -hmm. They call it ferrite. And so how do you know it's ceramic? Because they told you it's ceramic? Or no, because? because of the material that it's made out of. It's the black magnet, what we normally know of as a magnet, right? Ones that go on our refrigerators. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. That's all made out of ferrite. Neodymium is a rare earth metal, and it looks kind of like shiny, like chrome. Oh, I didn't know that. It's not black, yeah. It's oh, this one is really one. These two together? Yeah. <laughs> not even happening at all. Can you actually force them to go together? Well, that's how I killed this one. Oh, sorry. I forced this one on one of those uh -huh. <laughs> against polarity. So negative and negative, forcing it, like making it actually stay there? Well, no, the stronger one would take the magnetism away from the weaker one. And the stronger one would be this one? Yeah. And it killed this one? Yeah. So let's not kill that one. <laughs> I don't know how that's both and tiny things stronger than that bigger one. That's weird. Yeah, it's just the metal uh, that, it, that it holds. And these aren't neodymium, these are another metal still, another what they call a rare earth metal. Mm -hmm. That they mine they mine them in China. And the one on her stomach, that's basically you can get it out of a speaker, right? Right, right. That's a twenty thousand gauss um It's a car ferrite. Right. Basically? I mean it, it was actually manufactured for biomagnetic therapy. But I don't mean if I were to get one out of the car, yeah. would it do the same? Yeah, it depends on if it was the same size, right? You have to get a, a gaussimeter to measure the, the strength of the magnet because they're not all the same. They can even be the same physical size and not have the same magnetic strength. So how do you do that? You measure it with a, a there's a meter that you can get a gaussimeter. Are they expensive? Huh? Are they expensive? Kind of, yeah, like thirteen hundred bucks. I just want to measure one damn thing. I mean, how would you? I know, and, that, and that's the thing, right? This guy, this guy who I was working with at one point was trying to get me to buy a gaussimeter. But that's because he makes his he, he all he does is troll the 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 park the, the junkyards to salvage magnets and like this is one of his right and he got it he got it from the door right one of the things that holds the door open for fire alarms 
Oh, okay, yeah. Right, right, and he just wants to measure it, but I, I, I don't want to do it that way. I'd rather just buy ones that are manufactured for the healthcare, right, right. even if you know, even if it's more expensive, because I know that all of that measurement and stuff is done by them. Right. But yeah, I mean, you know, you can measure. So I'm gonna buy that um, the magnets that you bought. The how do you go about that? Um, the, it's the thing you got that's that cake or whatever. You said well, about. I mean, you can order it from She Life online. That's right. I think that's where I did. Yeah, it. C H I L I F E. She Life. I think She Life is who I did my certification through. Really? Okay. I think so. Yeah, yeah. That's not Dr. Goy's though, but yeah. Um, but yeah, just uh, you, you can buy them. That, those are from She Life. Right. So I, I think I got mine like this from Chile, too. Kind of self-made. I'm going to go get a milkshake. You want a milkshake? No. Yes, you do. <laughs> you know you got the munchies. <laughs> <laughs> Do you ever feel like you're being watched? She's just sleeping. Oh, no. <laughs> so wait, this is part of a pair? No, because I, you just gave it to me. Over oh. here, you walked over with it. I'm trying to see where it went. I have no Well, the odd number would be because of the pictures of that, or the one that you gave. I'm not sure now. Which one? I don't know. Yeah, there is an odd number. Mm -hmm. I don't know what to do with them. Well, there's one, there's one up there. Yeah. Did you count the two on her neck? Two like this? Yeah, remember it's for the... Oh, no, no, those are like, those are like these. Oh. Yeah, but I mean, it's an even number, so the other two, oh, we put two under the butt. The butt, yeah. Yeah, we can finish this. We have a lot more points to go. We can finish it tomorrow? Mm -hmm. yeah. Absolutely. 160 altogether. To go? No, we're at 90. Right. Well, actually, we're. More than halfway through. More than halfway through, yeah. We're at 74, but we need to get through, push through. Yeah, I thought about getting the, the, the Gauss meter. Your what? I did fill out this book, I got it. She's like, I didn't even lose my legs. I said, don't, because then you just do your table and stick to you. I'm going to go take a bit. I'm going to sit there. Well, because uh, that noise you've heard the last three times is our house. Well, you can talk to her. I think she's inside. I think so. She should, what time is it? She shouldn't be picking him up yet. It's 11.46. No, yeah, she's not picking him up yet. Okay. You can talk to her about driving the car and where. All right, I'll check. Well, I'll see. I'll she can go get your truck and pick it up. I'll check the activity first. That's what she wants to do. We take care of my dad and another older gentleman, so oh. her boss. Did I tell you what he told me today? Mm -hmm. He told me to tell you to go ahead and use his um thing to pay for 
Hey, yeah, we already told you that. A lot of years in this guy, you gotta watch people when you have them take uh, care of him. Because you know how women can be the. He did have the, her mom for like a. Uh, I guess it was in her sugar daddy, you'd say. His little girlfriend, whatever. But he's 84. <laughs> and I already got myself set up for life, you know? Yeah. I get the house and I get the car, the new car. So, you know, I got friends that want to get in there because he gives me anything I want. <laughs> This is the first time I've let anybody watch him, you know? Yeah. I mean, everybody that I've, like, even introduced him to, they, you know, they want to hang on him, like, kind of thing. live video. We have some clients coming in today.
Really, huh? Mm -hmm. No, they're good. I like their cob salad. The, the cob salad. Cob salad? Yep. What's that? Chicken, bacon, lettuce and tomato, avocado, boiled egg. Um, oh yeah, okay. it's it is like the bomb, and it's really big too. They make a really nice one. I think I might grab one for lunch. I try to stay alkaline as much as possible, but it's not easy. Because everything, well, everything good is acidic. Unless you eat solid with tuna straight out of the can, which is, can be good, right? Mm -hmm. But you're going to make up for the mayonnaise with salad dressing. And for salad with chicken, like top salad, right? Mm -hmm. and some cayenne pepper, right? Black pepper, cayenne pepper. Um, maybe some minced garlic. Uh, soy sauce is good. Yeah, because you're salting it, right? Soy sauce. And soak it in there. And then the next day, whatever you do with it, it's still going to be good. Huh. Three, four, six numbers. Our numbers. Hello. Mm -hmm. This is Erica. Um, yeah, she's in the. She's at the doctor's right now. Um, next week's one. Oh, it's twelve. I'm gonna need to go to this. I'm glad you did that. We're gonna have to reschedule that because we're in um, we're in California right now. Right. Okay. Thank you. You feel Bye. different? No, all I know is I feel really bad. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I know, I know. It's kind of hard to think about anything else. I don't know what you mean. Yeah, yeah. Sure. Um, for, for your eyes then, you have an eye doctor's appointment tomorrow. Are you? Yes. I think you made one. I made one with Bob. I already got my eyes done. And I don't know what the hell she's talking about. I don't think she does either. I'm supposed to go get my prescription. I'm uh, supposed to go out to take you and get his too. We both got our eyes shut. Ooh, that almost got you. <laughs> that would have hurt. Mm -hmm. When I pulled it off, it went like that. So, yeah, I would just go ahead and buy the whole set from She Life, you know? Right. And, and remember. Thank you, I just. I have it. It's yeah. right. No, I mean, I'll get it from him anyways. But. They're cool. I mean, he emails. He replies to my emails. He's cool. Uh, because I, I emailed him about the little neodymium ones. If you go to mm -hmm. on eBay, it just leads you right back to him. Right. For the little neodymiums, you know? Yeah. And the little neodymium is what, is what you need for the, uh, um, you know, under your feet. And I highly recommend that. Especially okay. because of your circulation here in the lower mm -hmm. legs. When you wear them under the feet, uh -huh. you will definitely feel it you first. Feel it right away. And you will feel it in your lower legs. What is it getting out of them? You're talking to her first. Okay. The magnets? <laughs> yes. You get get the little magnets. <laughs> get my back's pinched. Get the little magnets. Uh -huh. there, there will be about, not these are bigger. They'll be about this size. They'll be in that kit, right? They will be in the kit. You're going to only get eight in the kit. 
Let me show you mine. I'll show you mine. Hold on. I think I have mine in my bag. <sighs> she got one of my maggots, so. huh? Um, just, just the one kit thing that he has going on. Oh. What's the matter? What did you do? Day. You see, mine always have tape on them because I'm always wearing them. Mm -hmm. So I keep them in my bag. I just peel them off before I get in the shower mm -hmm. and I stick them back together. But this is what I do. These have white on the back and not black. And they're little. And they're, and they're little, but Thin, look. I mean. but You stick them on your legs? No, you no. stick them underneath your feet. No. In certain spots. Okay. Now. You walk with them all day? Yes. Now push. One, two of these together, push them together, red to red or black to black, push them together, right? Okay. You, now you, yeah. see, you see how they resist? Yeah. Now push these together. Oh, those were just a lot. Way more powerful. Mm -hmm. And these are made of the same material as those, the ones that you have, the ones from Spain. Right. Okay. Okay. So you it's take these, ones. right? You take them under your feet. Okay. And you wear them all day long? And you wear them all day long. You wear them as long as you can. Right and and that's why the best time to put them on, that's why I keep them in my bag, uh, is like right when you get out of the shower, because you just wear them all the way till the next time, even if you wear them to bed, and okay. you'll feel them, especially if you wear them to bed. But you'll, you'll definitely feel an increase in circulation in the lower legs. And if you put them on the spots corresponding to uh, there we are. There we are, yeah. Oh, great. Are we on video again today? <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> See, uh, reflexology. Reflex. There we go. We're on live video? Just look up. Mm -hmm. Just look up. <laughs> <laughs> look up uh, any reflexology chart. No. Right? I like this one because it's got the pretty pictures on it. Bam. Right? No. Uh -huh. You put, remember, on your right side of your body, uh -huh. the negative or the white one touches uh -huh. the body. On the left side of the body, the red touches the body. Okay, write that down, we'll forget it. Will you remember it? Right, okay. because it's the same thing we mm -hmm. do during okay. the therapy. Mm -hmm. Okay, and put them here, right, for your kidneys, all right? Mm -hmm. Here for your intestines. Okay. Here is the heart and the liver on the other foot, right? Okay. And I throw, you know, the other one you can put up here for your lungs. I put them down here for the testicles, you know, the ovaries for women and testicles for men, right? Uh, or if you have sciatica, you know, you can put it back there for your sciatic nerve. But magnets work on these points. Okay. Mm -hmm. And if you put them on these points with the negative on one side and the positive on the other, and you just tape them underneath, and I think Homeboy sells these for like two bucks a piece mm -hmm. or something like that. So I gotta call it, put in an order. Yeah. You know what I mean? Just get like I don't know forty, you know, yeah. or whatever. You know, mm -hmm. just like I have twenty around here. Or whatever. Right. And then okay. you know, or maybe I just put in a big order and then sell them in packs of. I think yeah, these come good. together in eight. Yeah. Packs of eight. Right. But but definitely, and okay. and and you would really be surprised uh, if you do this. You can do this every single day. You have to pee. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, and it'll it'll boost up your metabolism. Great. And yeah. Okay, yeah. hey, what's this? I might just want to pee. Yeah. <laughs> I need the key. <laughs> oh, it's oh, up okay. on the top on the okay. key. Huh? I don't know why he'll mark his keys. Well, the blue and it's the... That takes me forever. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. So, but this really does work. I should take, I should put mine on right now, actually. But you're not doing nothing. Yeah. Doesn't that hurt to walk on them? No. no. No, they're so thin that, you know, you get used to them real quick. Right. I would wear them to... Uh, Uh, Universal Studios mm -hmm. all day or for the fair. Yeah. We spend 
Oh, so you, you found the chain, right? No, no, no. Yes. Who spends a lot of time together? My son and I. Oh. So, me. where's mom? Right, she lives in the neighborhood. She's in uh, the next building over. A couple buildings over. I don't even want to know. <laughs> what were you doing? Doing your neighboring job right no, here? No, 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 no. No, we moved here on either side. When we split, it was like, you know, because this, close uh, Oakland is so much better right. than LA, you know that, right. for kids, right. you know what I mean? I mean, the traffic, the the, the school system, mm -hmm. the, the gangs, everything, mm -hmm. it's like, no, this is just a place to be. And besides, this is great for business. You know, we have an enclave here of holistic practitioners. Mm -hmm. There's an institute for hypnosis right down the street. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, there are a number of people. There are other neurofeedback people. There are other biomagnetism people. Mm -hmm. Did you write it back to work? No. Mm. <laughs> no, that's my son's mic. He's, how old is he? 10. And he writes that? Yeah. How the hell does he write that? I can barely write that thing. I think he's big. <laughs> yeah, he's, he's a big guy. I mean, he's already five foot one. Oh, he's my size and yeah. I'm five two. <laughs> <laughs> That's messed up. <laughs> Baby, his son is five foot one at ten. Oh my god. Um, I was like, how I said, what do you do? Right back to work and no, that's my son. I thought he was ten. Like he is, like five foot one. I said, Well, how did he <laughs> that's crazy? <laughs> he went to visit his cousin yesterday at Fine Night Farm. Uh he's taller than his cousin. His cousin's a marine. <laughs> <laughs> In my in my family, I'm the tallest person. In that yeah, are you? In the top, yeah, what are you? In that Oh wow, uh, I'm 41 percent uh, European and 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 uh, 59 percent African. I just got my DNA breakdown yeah. from ancestors. Wow. <laughs> yeah, yeah. My mom was asking me yesterday what you were. Uh, when that show, then uh, well, she wants to come, she wants to come down here and do that fiber immunology gig. Have you do it for? Yeah, definitely. So. I told her when she was down there, off and down with her, where they scam me again, too. Yeah. You ready for neuro? Yeah. All right, let's go. Neuro feedback.
Jesus, uh, great doctor of uh, great doctor of David, he makes it by day in or by by Moses and Aaron, he says, I tell you right, he goes, there's nothing wrong. He goes, I tell you right now, he goes, it's your heart. And he goes, I, I, I'll bet you anything. And then he goes, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, Moses and Aaron raise Jesus in from the dead because we got this folks coming. And then next thing I know, he's cutting my three of my hands. Okay. Yeah. And as he's dying, he's here to perform me at all. If anything, he can kneecap me down at nighttime while I'm trying to, I guess, uh, 
So we started with the first half uh, biomagnetic pair, and now we're finishing up with uh, alpha, theta, and 